eyes, my nose so snotty. Ugh. Well, hello, my offspring. Mother is here. Mommy cray cray. Ugh. Something's in my throat, sorry. But today we are talking about something that I always fail at, and that is Photoshop. I've tried to, you know, blur out the lines and make myself look a little bit better, only to realize in the end, I look actually worse. Or do I just look that bad in real life? Yeah, probably bad. We are gonna be looking at some Photoshop fails that are just absolutely embarrassing. They were supposed to be professional, and they hired the wrong person to do their pictures. It's like they hired me, because girl, I don't know how to do no Photoshop. Let's take a look at some of these fails and see what's going on. Oh, Seville. Seville. Okay, this looks like a, I don't know, what, what are they saying? Looks like it's a Spanish brand. I don't, is it corn oil? I don't know what the, control C that I, oh, shampoo, clearly it says shampoo. <laughs> but let's see whether the, oh, 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 what are they doing? Look at the mom's head. It's like, it's placed like on a really thick, almost man-like neck and the head is like sitting low. It's like if my head was down, down here and my neck was like this wide. Did they think that no one would notice? And this is on packaging. Someone decided to take this lady's head and just, let's just, let's just move it down a little bit. It looks like the little girl's hugging a man though. I would definitely say, this looks so fake. I mean, who would even, I don't know, I don't know. Wait, what is, it? I, I'm seeing a lot of Spanish language on these different things that are failed. I don't know what they're promoting. It looks like some type of competition or some type of camp. And you see the writing on him, but take a look at that arm. They needed that to show the whole brand name because his arm basically goes from here to here. He basically has double the forearm that he's supposed to have. It looks so unnatural. And you can see like the wave in it. <laughs> Normally, if he did this, this is where this would stop, right around his shoulder. But they've extended it at least another foot past his shoulder, and we're just not supposed to notice that, really, folks? I mean, who did they have do this? It looks like my daughter did this. It looks like my five-year-old decided to try her hand at Photoshop, and this is what she came up with. No! Oh! Dude, this cannot be... Fanta, I remember the Fanta commercials from a, a little while back, a few years back, where the girls are like, Fanta, 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 something like that. And this is one of the girls that she has a beautiful face, there's a nice soda, the red background, great body, but wait, what is that? Why does she have Shaquille O'Neal's arm that's hanging down and it has like the little even armband they wear oh, in Andrew. basketball? I mean, this like a big gorilla arm on the side of her body, but that is not the biggest Photoshop fail in this photo. There's more folks. Whoever did this decided to take it up a notch and do two fails in one. We are getting a two for people. Look at the hand and arm holding the Fanta. It looks like one giant long hand that's just extending. She doesn't have an arm. Her arm is literally missing. The Fanta is just coming out. This is this is how the Fanta's coming out. That That's the Fanta, right there. There it is, that's the Fanta. Like really, we're not supposed to notice that my arm is completely gone out of this. You call this professional? Come on, Fanta, we have to do better. Okay. Look at this picture. Oh, it looks like a mom and a son. Looks like it's Christmas time, the holidays. This is an ad for some beautiful stuff. Oh, it looks so nice. But wait, what is this? Oh, look at mommy. Mommy has the longest feet and legs in the world. I mean, what is this lady? Look how, look at the dimensions. Either she has the shortest torso in the world or someone's been playing with Photoshop again. Why are her legs so long? Why is she so tall she can look over a stair railing? I am tall, but I still can't look over a stair railing. This looks so fake. It's, and even with the high heels, there's no high heels in the world that would make you this tall. This is an absolute fail. Oh, take a look at this. This is, I don't know what the name of this model is, but I've seen her around. She's really pretty. Upon first glance, even when I saw it, I didn't notice anything wrong. It just looks like, you know, she's modeling for a magazine. But I want you to take a look at her legs. Yeah, she's missing 
her leg. And it's not bent like the other one and coming across. It's going straight down and it's missing. Did they think that we wouldn't notice that she's missing her leg? And I think in real life, this woman does have both of her legs. This makes no sense. This is like an absolute fail. How could you miss that her leg is gone when you edited this photo? Really? Someone needs to be fired. Okay, here's another woman, a model. She's beautiful. She's obviously advertising some type of bathing suit. She looks gorgeous. I don't see anything wrong until you move down closer to her hips. And you see something's not quite lining up with the other. If you see her stomach is going this way, then all of a sudden it's like, ah, ah. and some may say, well, she's just kind of moving that way. No, I mean, this is so bad. And it looks like this is a website where you're shopping on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're, dumb. We're not dumb, we can see it. I'm not stupid and I'm not dumb. Okay, it looks like someone's selling a USB drive or flash drive, okay, common thing. But wait, look, I don't know if I'm sticking that in my computer because look how big it is. How are you sticking that in your computer? And I get it, maybe they wanted people to focus on the product, but they should have just had it sit there and not in her hand because we're gonna assume it's the size of a remote control. Last time I checked, there isn't an adapter for that. You're not gonna find anything in the marketplace that you can put a USB drive that big into your computer. I guess they're trying to pull you in as well with how big it is. And then look at the price, it's only 367. Actually, to me, that's a, 367, how do you advertise something with the seven? I've seen with a nine on it, 399, or maybe even 369, but 367. I guess that two extra cent is gonna get you to buy this too big of a thumb drive that will never fit in anything that you own. Last but not least, we are gonna have a good day with some oats. But take a look at the oats. Wait, what? Now, I don't know if this was done on purpose to kind of give it like a weird look, but I don't think they meant for it to look like this. And this oatmeal is the same size as her torso. Like you are getting a lot of, I mean, this oatmeal is like going from here to here. What, what, second of all, she's running on the beach with oatmeal. Who said running on the beach with a box of oatmeal was gonna inspire anyone to buy this oatmeal? And then it says win $25,000. So what are you advertising? Are you advertising oats? Is this a giveaway, a beach vacation? I don't know what this ad is. Someone break it down for me. The Photoshop on here is absolutely ridiculous. It's like this. This is what this looks like. This this is this is me holding the oatmeal box. This is what I look like. It's a fail. The whole company needs to be thrown in the trash. Throw it away. That's it guys for Mommy Cray Cray. Make sure you check out me on Instagram and subscribe to my channel. Give this video a like or don't give it a like. <laughs> Make sure you check out my kids' channel, The Nye and Ellie Toy Show. They have way more subscribers than me, and sometimes you can catch me on there doing creepy things. <laughs> my ear itch. All right, girl. Ooh. Bye, guys. See you next time. Ooh, why is my ear?